Hey, I just wanted to show you what all we got down. We're down south here in the Ozarks at our homestead we're working on. And I just wanted to show you what we got done this weekend. I hadn't really had time to film and I apologize. My computer's been messed up. I'm not sure when I'm going to get this one up, but um, my computer's been messed up and I've been so busy I didn't have time to film a lot this weekend so this is what we got done it's a uh, 30 by 48 and we just poured half of it because that was quite a bit of work right there we had my son and his girlfriend her two sisters her dad and my wife and we, we all got her done and it didn't come out perfect finish but it didn't come out half bad either so and then we ordered a little extra and I'll take you right up here my son he took some uh, those IBC forms you know those styrofoam concrete forms and put them together and he's gonna make like a little greenhouse it's kind of like a wallapini in a way but it's going to be buried up a little bit but he's plans on raising maybe a little tank of fish and some hydroponics in there it's not very big it's only eight by 16 but we put that in there and he's got these pipes he set in every four feet we're gonna put hoops you know we just we got a harbor freight pipe bender you know one of the roll benders and then we got some conduit and we're gonna bend them up and put them in there it's gonna make his own little door about a four foot door so he got plenty of room he can get one of those big uh ibc totes in there that way so We've been pretty busy and then we did some crossing work with some concrete some we mixed by hand with my mixer and it broke down so we ordered a little bit extra on the truck and dumped it down there so hopefully that solved our water problem we had like a it was like a three inch rain in 30 minutes and They've had bigger rains than that too lately, so it, this area is flooded. It washed the crossing out of the river and that we crossed to get here, and part of Highway 14 up here, you know, between Ava and Ozark, is closed down because it started to slide off the mountain. So uh, it's been closed down. It's been a mess. Anyway, stay tuned because we're going to run up and look at my cave here in a minute. So, it's up the hill there and all that trees and brush up there. So, just stay tuned. We'll take you up there. Alright, um, we're up here at the cave. We're gonna, we got the ladder down in there. You see the hole. It's not too... It drops down in there pretty good. I don't know if you see the bottom or not. But anyway, I'm fixing the hat in there. So here I go. <laughs> you don't have to claw, claw, climb on the side of the ladder to get in. Yeah, we're down in here now. And uh, here I'll let my son film this so you can get a perspective of how big it is. Hold on. Yeah, I can stand up in here a little ways. It don't go very far. Give me my other light. 
Never go down in a cave without three sources of light. But I know this don't, you know, and you don't want just Chinese crap. You want something good. We got Chinese crap. But we can see the entrance. The cave didn't go so very far, so you ain't going to get lost down here. But we're just down? exploring in case it goes. Yeah, I got a little salamander over here somewhere. There he is. There he is. Yeah. And then that goes back. You gotta crawl to get back in there. That's about 10 more feet back. I'd say it's about. 15, 20, 25, about 30 foot long altogether. This cavern I got. We don't really call it a cavern, but. And then, you see up in there, goes back a ways, but we might be able to. Knock a little rock out. Get in there, but the ceiling kind of makes me nervous because it's just a bunch of cracked rock and stuff, so it kind of makes you nervous a little bit. But I'm not too scared. And right here is a bunch of trash, and I think that goes out to another little entrance, but uh armadillos keep packing leaves in there all right so that's about and here's a little place it's right underneath this place and it goes back away so I may go back in there one of these days and explore that a little bit see if I can't dig it out and get back in there oh. Oh, and then that goes back from the 30. It probably goes back about 10 more feet that way, but it looks like it's pretty much caved in and stuff. And there's a way out. So, if you fell down in here, I don't know. I don't know if I could climb out, maybe. But I doubt it, because it's so narrow and and it widens out so but anyway that's my little cave maybe five foot wide at five or six foot wide at the widest part all right I don't know what all this stuff is float oh I guess that's dust particles off my fingers all righty well don't forget to like Sub, 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 subscribe and share <laughs> I can't even talk down here alright next time YouTube bye